When speedrunning Minecraft, it can be beneficial to get a village. This way, you can get resources such as obsidian and iron. So to find a village, it can be a bit difficult. However, by using the trusty pie chart, we can actually find a village. First off, you need to know how to navigate the um, pie chart. It's pretty simple. There's two things, a number and a few words. To the left is the button you will press on your keyboard and the word on the right is where you want to navigate to. So in this case, if I wanted to go to game renderer, I press one. If I want to go to update display, I go I press two. Right. But in this case, I'm not going to do that. To find a village in Minecraft using the pie chart, we have to go to tick and then level, then entities, and then block entities. So in my case, that was 4113 on the keyboard. Next, we're going to bring up our running distance until we see either bell, a smoker, a brewing stand, or any professional block job you can get in Minecraft. So, I can already see there's a bell and a smoker, which are signs of a village nearby, especially the bell. Now, we're going to reset the pie chart by decreasing our running distance by 5, and increasing it again by 4. This essentially resets it. Okay, so you can see all the blocks are gone. And this allows us to fine tune the area of our village. So you can go to a neighboring chunk, essentially like this. So bring up borders, in case you haven't already. And you want to find, like, you want to, you want to find those blocks again. All right. And this direction that's going to be in, because where they popped up in. And as you saw, the chunks that I went into did have these blocks pop up, which mean that they went in this direction. This is the way to go and I'm going to continue on this direction for a while. But I see you up there already. This is the village that I have found. Obviously there's an iron golem here. Subscribe if you want more videos just like this one. See ya!